in my vlog. January 1st, 2020, first run of the year, heading up there. Whew. Let's get on this trail, beautiful day. That's a great start to the new year. how good this morning is. It's incredible. So, uh, while I hike up this hill here, talk about one of my biggest challenges last year, which was juggling family work and training for ultras. It's, uh, it's tough. You kind of feel guilty taking off on your you know, one free day of the week or one of your two free days of the week to go run all day when you haven't seen your kids all week or your wife haven't walked your dog. It, uh, it kind of sucks. One of the big things that's helped with that this year is I run commute to and from work. So instead of sitting in a car, wasting away my time every morning and afternoon I'm running to work getting in about eight or nine kilometers a day of pretty flat road but at least I'm moving that allows me to put about 40 kilometers a week on my feet without feeling like I'm taking away from family time at all and huge shout out to my work they put in a shower in the new building so I can shower when I get in it's actually a really nice way to start my day every day so, that's been huge, but I still end up spending five or six hours every Saturday or Sunday running when I feel like I could be hanging out with my kids and my wife and my dog. And that's been tough. I've been getting Tilly out for little runs with me. That's kind of fun. We might even try and do a trail race together this year. And. I find ways of fitting it in. I usually get up really early and on some days, especially in the middle of summer when the days are long, if I get up before the sunrise and get on the trail in the dark, there's been a few days where I can put in 30 kilometers and be back before they're done breakfast, which is awesome. Or a day like today where I'm gonna do my run and they're gonna meet me at the end of it and then we'll be out here at the park, have a bit of family time. But there's some days where I just burn the whole day and don't do anything with them. That's hard on the family. And it's hard on me. I definitely feel guilty about that. Something I'm definitely gonna have to work on and figure out a solution for in 2020. fun little 16k loop around the Diaz Vista Trail at Bunsen Lake. Pretty perfect way to start the year. 
And uh, now I'm just heading down to the lake to meet the family and uh, maybe go for a quick polar bear plunge. You recording? Yep. All right. Go, go. Face Put your shoes on. You dummy.